those monsters, they're, they're gonna get me. Those what? What's the matter? Those things. They keep coming. They scare me. Make it stop. Can you be a little more vague, please? Welcome back, everybody, to Fallout on Tale of Two Wastelands with the Capital Punishment mod list time the bearded og and uh, we are just leaving megaton here uh, i got all fixed up i am in very good condition no hurt limbs no radiation uh, no thirst no hunger no sleep deprivation and no ill effects so we are in very good condition uh, one thing we do want to do however is we want to put our combat armor on and uh, we are headed into town into the city or at least the outskirts of the city to see if we can find those pressure valves as we continue to um, fix up our place here. So that is the plan for today's episode. I want to apologize in advance for any sniffling and sneezing. I am suffering right at the moment from, oh shit, uh, seasonal allergies and it's just kind of been kind of hit me hard today. So yeah, all right, we got a firefight going on up here. Man, there's a bunch of dudes down there. Maybe we can uh, re relive this again. We were here a few days ago, and I ended up snipering a lot of these guys. And we got a lot of good stuff in the process, so um, let's go ahead and get prone here. Bring out Betsy. Okay, so it looks like we got, uh, they're all raiders. Okay, so there's a total of five of them. If we snipe them from here, they might not know that we're here. And if they come after us, then we'll take them out. Okay, so let's do this. Off with your head. Alright, so they're alerted, but they don't see us. At least not yet. Oh shit, there's six of them. There's five left. Alright. Oh man, how the fuck did that miss? Okay, they're onto us now. So let's uh, get back over this way and uh, maybe what we'll do is we'll kind of circle around this way. I don't know, I don't know if this game <coughs> uh, takes trajectory into account when you're sniping. Um, I don't think that it does because I was, I mean, I have to go, oh shit, I'd have to go back and look. Well, get out of here. I have to go back and look at the video, but I thought I was right on that enemy's head. <laughs> okay, well, let's just work our way back over here. All right, there's some, but there's at least one of them right on the other side of this rock. I don't know if it's just one or more, though. Chicken shit. Hey, Papa. Oh, there's at least two. Hmm, I see one down there and one way down there. These other two are. They sounded like they were right on the other side of this rock. Oh, there they are. Holy shit! Okay, 
let's get over here. There's somebody way over here. I hit him, but I certainly didn't kill him. Oh, I was going to tell you guys something else, too. Um, if I press left alt, then I can lean. But I have to hold it down, which is kind of weird. But it does work. Got him. I really like this 45 pistol. Okay, since we're so close to Megaton, we're going to loot everything and just take it back and sell it real quick. You know what? Let's keep this out just in case I miscounted. There was six in total, so this is the second one. Scatter sawed-off shotgun. This is number three. Number four. This was their victim. Okay, here we go. I think that's all of them. Uh, let's take a look at this real quick. So, we just got a bunch of shit Raider armor here. And, um, we got this scatter shotgun. And I guess, were the rest of them, yeah, I guess they just had a bunch of melee weapons. Okay, so yeah, I'm just going to go sell all that stuff and then I'll meet you guys um, right, at, right around this area here in just a moment. All right, guys, we have a rad scorpion chasing us. Um, I want to try something real quick. Let's throw a... Um, what's the difference between these two? That's weird. I want to use fire against this thing and see if it... Actually damages it. Where are you? Uh, where are you going? No, nah, it hit. It hit. Uh, it showed the armor thing. So that means fire doesn't do anything to it at all. Okay. Yeah, I'm. I'm not gonna waste armor piercing ammo on it then. I'll just run. Run away from it. Okay. So, we haven't been any further than Super Derpa Mart here. Oh, shit. Repops. So that seems to suggest Super Duper Mart is repopped, too. We need to go back in there to get uh, lockers. Yeah, I don't know where that other one went. Um, oh, we got caution. Oh, right there. I 
How? How is it that I'm out of shotgun shells? You're, you weren't shooting at me, were you? Am I? Wait a minute. No, I've got 118 20 gauge rounds. I don't know why that wasn't loading. Okay. We're going to take those. Uh, I'm going to take them as submachine gun for now. We're not going to take the armor because it's just going to be too damn heavy. But I could come back here later and grab it. Maybe. We'll see. All right, let's take, um, let's just take a bandage here. Actually, yeah. Yeah, let's take a bandage. Oh, it's almost 9 p.m. I, I didn't realize it was so late in the day. No wonder it's so damn dark out. Take that, that. And again, we're going to leave the armor for now. Might come back and get later. Okay, let's look at our map. So, yeah, basically we just need to go straight ahead and find some sewers in there. Let's do an antiseptic and a bandage and an expired stem back. If we can get into the sewers, then it won't really matter if it's nighttime or not because we'll be indoors. Uh, I just don't know if we're going to be able to walk right up there without any resistance whatsoever. Be kind of surprised if that happened. Uh, no. Just making sure everybody's loaded. I think two. I want to put frag mines on. Eh. May eh, no, I don't think I will. At least not yet. Because everything that I currently have on the hot bar, I want to keep there. I doubt we can just walk right up there with nothing, nobody resisting us. Those monsters, they're, they're going to get me. What? Those what? What's the matter? Those things. They keep coming. They scare me. Make it stop. Can you be a little more vague, please? Unless you tell me what the problem is, I can't help you. Those things. It's all their fault. They did this to us. Um... I, I have no speech. What am I supposed to do? No. Those things. Stop your whining. No. You don't care. The grown-ups never cared. Now they're all dead. Well, fine. You'll just die, too. Uh, I'm sorry, okay? I'm not really, but I have to say it. <laughs> Please don't get mad at me. I'm scared. I don't know what to do. Well, you could start by giving me a little more details. How's that? Just help me. Promise you'll help me. Uh, maybe. <laughs> I'd like to help, but I need to know more first. Yeah, exactly. Those big things. They're all over Great Itch. Oh. They killed everyone. So you're the second maniac that's been wander uh, running around yelling about Great Itch. We're going to have to probably please, go there, huh? Please find my papa. Your papa, huh? What happened here? Are we in Great Itch? Yeah, tell me more about the things attacking Great Itch. Well, they're big, ugly things that crawl around on six legs. So, like rad roaches? Got huge teeth and skitter around, grabbing everything in their path. Okay, so you have a rad roach infestation. My papa would infestation. always say they're fucking ants. Oh, they're ants! Well, okay. That's what he used to call them anyway. 
Okay. I just call them fire ants. Oh, fire ants. Shit. Okay. How do you hurt them? My papa had a gun. He said it hurt those things. But he said they were the dumbest fucking ants he ever saw. <laughs> Kid's potty mouth. He kept telling everyone to shoot for their antenna. Whatever that means. Shoot them in the antenna. Okay. Have they always been around? No. Nah, those things started coming around only in the last few months. Okay. At first, they just crawled around outside our town. But later, they came into town. And, well, you know the rest. Okay. Um, let me ask you something right. else. What is it? Uh, is there anywhere you can hide? Yeah. Can you hide somewhere and stay safe until I can go deal with it? Well, there is the personal shelter next to the old diner. Okay. Papa always said to stay away from it. But I guess it's supposed to be safe. Mm, I don't know. Maybe it is, maybe it isn't. But if Papa said to stay away from it, maybe you shouldn't go in there. I don't know. I'll head over there and wait inside. Oh, okay. Hurry back. All right. That was weird. Quest added those. <laughs> okay. We have a new quest. Those. The whole great itch business. All right. Let's see if we can make it over to this sewer without getting killed. I'm just doing a little bit of reconnoitering here. Uh-oh. Something already sees us, but I don't know what it is. Turn my camera light off. Too much glare on the screen. I see what looks to be a mole rat with a saddle, which usually means a traitor. Okay. We are in the sewers here, and uh, we're looking for industrial valves, water water valve thingies. What are those called? Uh, let's see, data, miscellaneous, no quests. Replacement valves. We're looking for water replacement valves. Am I prone? Yep, I was prone. <laughs> okay, so... Oh. We got ferals in here. I think... Before we go into another area let's stay in the outer area first and make sure it's clear oh shit all right our little leaning ability here. Okay, here. Go this way. 
That must lead down to that lower door. I hear footsteps down there. I hear something this way too. Okay, that way's clear. how to come upstairs what's he doing oh he's coming around this way he'll hit our mine there we go he padded all the way up around the, the long way. Bottle caps. All right, there was some loot in this uh, cubby back here. We can't open an average safe. Oh, we got a 32 rifle. 12 gauge rounds, 32 rounds. Some nice parts, some 10 millimeter, and a lot of nice medical supplies. Okay. That was definitely a good haul there. I don't think I'm going to take that junk stuff. Oh, let's, uh, let's see if there's anything else down here. Yeah, this is where we came in at. Okay. See some rad scorpions, or not scorpions, sorry, uh, roaches. Let's just use our 10 millimeter pistol on them. Oh shit. Got him. Looks like that way is blocked. There's a dead person in here. Um I guess we'll Take the leather armor. Oh, we can't get into that. Anything up here? Another rad roach down there.
There's a door. Okay, nothing up that direction. Um, okay, so there's a way up and a way down. Uh, let's... let's go up first. I hear footsteps. This door is activated elsewhere. Oh. Oh, man. We're definitely getting our lockpicking up to at least 25 next time we level. I'm like four points shy of the easy level. All right. Well, whatever's in there, we're not getting in there right now. Got him. Well, these uh, ferals are a good source of bottle caps. So does this go back out into Yeah, more more sewer. Alright, I wanna go investigate down below first before we leave this area. We have a storeroom and we have a feral in here. He was armored. I hear more. But we're hidden at the moment, though. Antiseptic. Oh shit! <laughs> that scared me. Oh, we're still in danger. For some reason, my weapon keeps like losing its ammo or something. It's really weird. Okay, I hear a ghoul somewhere. Is, though. There it is. Oh shit. Don't jam. It's like a the shotgun thinks I'm switching my ammo when I'm not. We we need to get this thing repaired. 
it's jamming up on me too much and malfunctioning. There he comes. Good lord, how many of them are there? Okay, I guess that's it. This was a nice little cubby to kind of get away from him in. Whew, okay. Guess that's everything. I've already looted these two guys. That's a cinder block. Combat knife, 13 for one. Eh, all right, I'll pick it up. It's not the best. Here, we can open this. Thirty-two rounds. Oh, nice! A weapon repair kit. I think we probably should maybe just use that right now. Good. Okay. Maybe this thing won't malfunction quite as much now. Ammo box. Thirty twos. Okay, well, I'm gonna go out on, out on a limb here and say we've probably eliminated most of the ferals in this immediate vicinity. Let's go down to the lower section and just make sure it's completely clear and also why don't we give ourselves a bandage and an empire expired stem back no that's just me bandaging oh are you alive not anymore you are oh shit I guess I went out on a limb <laughs> and fell off the damn limb. All right, that means we need to still be prepared here. I, f I would have figured that one would have come running, you know, because you're just right above its head making all that noise. Ooh. Is that, is that steam or something? It's rad roach. Oh, you know what that might be is a gas leak, actually, which means we don't want to ignite it. <laughs> yeah, um, probably pulling out my shish kebab flaming sword where there's a gas leak is not a good idea. I'm thinking. That's just dirty water there. Okay, I think we're done down here. Okie dokie. Let's go. Looks like I see a rad roach. Let's use our 10 mil for those. Less expensive to fire this. Plus I have a lot more ammo too than I do for 45. Uh, 32 rounds and another 32 rifle. Okay.
Okay, it looks like there's two ghouls over that way. Eliminated them. Combat stem, a blue pass card. Don't see anything up that way. That's a dead end. See another ghoul way over that way. Does he have a buddy? See. There's also a a dead wastelander. I'm not gonna take the Brahmin skin outfit. see anything in this section but there might be something over that way dead in that way got something going on up there we have another mercenary I'll take the leather armor for, uh, excuse me, for now. Okay, so we can either go that way or that way. Let's go this way. Oh, we got a trap here. Uh, I th think this is a grenade bouquet. Yeah, right there. We don't have the skill with my mods to disable this. So let's just trip it and then get out of the way. All right, uh, before we go that way, I just let's just take a quick peek up here. Oh, where does this go? Ladder to sewer way station. Let's go that way just to mark it on the map. Oh, rad scorpion. Okay, never mind. <laughs> we'll deal with that later. I'm not taking a 10 pound vacuum cleaner or a 10 pound steam gauge assembly. I think I may have a couple of those anyways, but if we ever need that for anything, oh, caution, then we know where to go. There's another trap right there, but it looks like it's already been sprung.
What the hell is that? Those look like gnomes. Okay, that's locked. We can't get in there. I have a bad feeling about this. So what we're going to do is... Oh, we're detected by rad roaches. Okay, so we got whatever is behind there. Oh, danger! Gallo? What is that guy? He had some kind of weird looking face. So let's not, not stand near the frag mine if he comes out the door. He looked like a like a demonic clown or something. Is he He's still alive. We crippled him. out here, dude. Whatever. I've got better things to do. Oh, there he is right there. I'm ahead. I'm ahead. Got him. Oh, he's a... Okay, so he's a... A sentient ghoul with a party hat on. Nice. 88 bottle caps. Tales of Junkie Jerk Jerktown Vendor whatever. <laughs> Jerktown. Junktown Jerky Vendor. A short barrel, which is in pretty good shape. Trading outfit, which is in good shape. Party hat, which is in good shape. Okay. With that with that clown hat on, he was like I couldn't quite tell what the hell was going on there. Um I think we're just in danger because of these guys. He keeps rad roaches for pets. We're still... Still have caution. We kill them both? Okay. Take the bottle caps off the U. Strange meat. No, thank you. A paint gun. That's very heavy. We're not taking it. We will take wonder glue, though. If I can actually get to the wonder glue. There it is. We can't get into an easy terminal. Or an easy safe. Let's pick our mind back up. A sensor module. Okay. Oh, wow. Look at all these bottle caps. Five, five, six. Nah, oh, there we go. Got stuff in those boxes. Foot locker. All right. Um, we got some darts. A camera that's kind of heavy. Gallo storage key. No, we're not gonna do that. 
Those books weigh a pound and they only have a value of five though, so they're not really worth it. We'll take all his nukas. And baseball bat. Okay, I guess we're done. In here, but we got a storage key. Is that does that go to this room here, I'll bet? Yes, it does. Oh, wow. Look at all the stuff in here. Damn, son. Okay. We're going to... We can't just take everything. Um, we're going to have to be a little bit judicious here. We'll take the Mintats. High pressure valves. That's what we need. All right. Nice. Mission accomplished. Install the replacement valves to restore the water supply. Fantastic. Okay. Got some nice medical stuff there. Um, 12 gauge rounds. Just want to kind of look at everything closely. We're not taking heavy stuff or, you know, stuff that doesn't have a good weight to value ratio. But we will take Rad X. We'll take ammo and drugs for sure. Well, we won't take drugs. Well, you know what I'm talking about, right? Fishing batteries, we'll take those. Nuka Cola. Kind of hard to get at all this stuff. 10 millimeter rounds. No, we don't need one more blades. There's a stim pack down there. Can we get to that? Yeah, nice. A belt and some lunch boxes. Okay, well, we know where we can come back to if we ever need a bunch of parts. A Braxo cleaner. I mean, I know we need that for certain things, but it has a terrible weight value to weight ratio. So I think we'll leave those there. Just note to self, if we ever need a bunch of a Braxo cleaner, there's six boxes in here. Fantastic. Okay. We have accomplished our mission. Um, I think we're going to go back the way we came because I don't want to have to deal with that rad scorpion in that other exit. Plus, who knows where it's actually going to take us to. It'd be kind of nice to, to know that, though, more for future reference. Damaged garden gnome. Okay. Is there anything up here? Doesn't look like it. All right. Well, I think then, guys, I'm just going to meet you back at the garage. As usual, I'll keep the camera running in case something crazy happens. But if not, I'll see you guys back at the garage. All right, guys. Uh, I just came out of the sewer and I discovered this place called Wilhelm's Wharf. And it looks like there might be a vendor over here. We're detected, but we're not being shot at. So that's always a good sign. Let's put our weapon away. Grandma Sparkle. Well, look at this. We got us a wanderer all the way out here in Wilms Wharf. You must got some important business out here to be wandering around. Uh. But tain't none of my beeswax what you're doing. <laughs> but if you're interested in trading, maybe we can help each other. Okay. I'm very interested in trading. Um. Yeah, what are... What are you doing way out here? My boys are hunting lurks. Finest meat you could get. But yeah. you don't move around in your stomach like Mole Rat does. <laughs> okay. Right dangerous, those things. Just as soon take your head off as look at you. Watch yourself out here. They're all over. Yeah, I know. I, I know all about my lurks, and you're right. Their meat is actually pretty good. Tastes like lobster. Uh, what's going on around here? Some fellas came out here a while ago that said they was looking for some do-gooder that came out from one of them vaults. A do-gooder? Oh, man. Do-gooders that come out of vaults, we don't trust them at all. I told them I ain't seen nobody like that and sent them on their way. Okay. They might still be around here, though, if you think you can help them. You're not, like, talking about the Talon mercenaries, are you? In fact, you're not the one that hired them to kill me, are you? I hope you're not, because you seem like a nice lady, and I'd hate to have to take your head off. Uh, anyway, let's trade. I was good to hear. Let's see what you got. Okay. She has 149 caps, 
But she seems to be a food vendor, which is fine. Um, I will take... Oh, here. Hold on. Okay, let's uh, put... I had to dump a few things back in the sewer because I was too heavy. Let's put this on. Lurks ain't got gotcha you yet, I see. Not yet. Okay, so we will trade you that meat, the pre-war money. Do I have any junk? I don't. Okay, so looks like that's all we can actually sell her. Um, I would, uh, ooh, she's got lots of dirty water. Thing is, I don't know if I have enough weight to carry this back, because then we can go purify it up at the water plant. That's, that's 12 pounds. Hmm. Does she have any more steamed Mirelark? She does. Oh, she has, she's got 10 of those. Oh, nice. Okay. Um, let's accept. That gets us up to 507 caps. Yup. 268, two, yeah, see, we don't have enough for all those waters. We have seven pounds that we can that we can deal with Lurks, I got you yet. so let's buy seven pounds worth of dirty water the uh wait a second how much do these weigh a pop a uh, one pound each okay so let's buy seven of these actually no let's buy four so we have a little tiny bit of weight left over All right, I you seem like a very nice lady. I hope that you I hope that you have people protecting you cuz this is an extremely dangerous place. Thank you, grandma. Uh no, we're not going to steal from grandma. Uh no, I'm not picking that. Now, is this a different vendor up here? Oh, I wonder if this is one of those Yeah, this is one of those traveling thingies. Organization at some point, when we have a thousand caps to spare, we'll we'll buy the season pass or whatever the hell it's called from them guys, and then we can just use them to fast travel. Interesting. Okay, I'll meet you guys back at. Uh, actually, we'll stop off in Megaton first and sell. Uh, some of this extra stuff that I have. Hey, Moira. Oh, I can't wait to hear how the repellent's working. Um, we're... We're not done yet. Wow, it repels them that much. Yep. Okay, let's, uh... Sell. What do you need? She has... Oh, good. She has lots of caps. Alright, we're gonna sell darts and nails... And liquid nitrogen. Mintats. Service revolver. 32 rifle. Defense submachine gun. And the short barreled shotgun. Combat knife. Okay, let's accept that. That gets us up to. I've gained the Barter Town perk one. What? Okay, I guess we gained some kind of barter perk. We'll have to look at that. Okay, I want all armor piercing rounds that you have for sale. Which is hardly anything, unfortunately. Let's take your 45 auto rounds. And I'll take your 4 P rounds. By the way, that stands for uh, pressure. Uh, Overpressured rounds. More powerful, but they do more durability damage, too. Um, how are we doing on 556s? Five, five, Normal 556s. Five, five, we have 159. Yeah, I think I'll hold off on that for now. Do you have a weapon repair kit? 
Yes. Okay, we'll buy that from her. Um, how am I doing for splints? I've got four. Let's buy a couple splints off of you as well. An incinerator. That must be like a flamethrower, I guess. Metal helmet. Let's buy your bobby pin. Okay. So that leaves us with 441 caps. Don't hurt yourself. Achievement unlocked. You run Barter Town. Sell 10,000 caps worth of goods. Okay, so does that give us uh, a new perk, though? Barter Town. Your business prowess gives you discounts wherever you shop. With each rank of this perk, items you buy now cost 10% less. Ah, oh, nice. Just buy, not sell? Not that I'm complaining. I'll take it. Very cool. We run Barter Town. Okay. Let's go home and get these uh, water... What the hell? Uh, get these water valves installed. Actually, though, let's get our do our water f first. So we have... Let's go to aid. Four dirty water. Purification in progress. I think he said we have access to this for one in-game week, and then we have to pay another 70 caps. I mean, that's not really a bad deal, all, all things considered. I mean, I still think he should give it give us access to the purifier for free for everything we did for him, but, you know, you got to take what you can get, I suppose. Um, Do I have any scrap metal to sell him? Eh, miscellaneous. Crafting ingredients. I've got two scrap metal. Well, you know what? We should probably hang on to some of that. I bet you we're going to need it for something. Make a ton of Okay. Let's go back to the garage. Alrighty. I believe we go downstairs to install these valves. Install valves and restart the pump. Oh, that sounds good. A water... Oh, a water purification module. Oh, man, we got to get that. Okay. Nice. So we now have plumbing, ladies and gentlemen. We have electricity and plumbing. Uh, activate irrigation control. Look at that. We just have to figure out how, you know, we get seeds to plant in here. I'm sure, I'm sure the mod will make that, um, known to us, you know, in due time. All right, well, let's not, uh, let's not keep the water running right now because it's not doing any good. Amazing. It is amazing. Does my bathroom now have water we can drink? I mean, it's going to probably be irradiated still. Yeah, five rads. But at least we can do it here. We don't have to do it at the water treatment plant now. Very nice. Okay. Not that we need to necessarily. I mean, we have a lot of uh, purified water. I have more in storage, too. Uh, speaking of which, we probably need some of this. All right, guys, I think that is going to wrap up this episode here. We can drink from there as well. And so what we're going to do in the next episode is... Did it give us the next stage of this quest? Because I want to keep working on our base. Uh, let's see, quests. Fight. Oh, yeah, storage containers. I think those are back at the Super Duper Mart. Um, plus, we know that it's been repopped, so we'll go kill all the bandits or uh, uh, raiders bandits raiders same thing <laughs> uh, in there and um you know get all their stuff and and then we'll get the the lockers and bring those back so that will be the plan for the next episode uh we also have to deal with that kid brian wilkes 
Um, and I think that's also this quest is also associated with that great itch place that we we've heard about a couple of times too. So that'll probably be the next thing after we, uh, you know, finish the Springvale Garage quest line. But I'm liking this, man. Our place is getting better, better and better. We got lighting. We got uh, uh, water, uh, plumbing, right? And, you know, just kind of looking around, it looks like there's going to be more things that are going to get filled in here. So this is going to be a cool place when it's all said and done. All right. With that being said, thanks, everybody, for watching. hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment, share the video. Catch you all in the next episode. Bye-bye.